Little C76 here. Um, I got a webcam. <laughs> um, so today I get to play. What am I looking for? My controller. That's what it is. I get to play some Resident Evil today. Resident Evil 4 Plus controls. So I'll stick with that one. Um, I will, of course, pick hard mode because, you know, Team Spronkham or MLG Pro. So, um, so I've got old Chris and I've got current Jack Chris, old Jill and fancy blue outfit Jill. You know what? I really want to go with that one just for the nostalgia reason, but I actually played as Jill for my playthroughs when I was a kid. Um, so I will go with Jack Chris. Just sitting there like, just crushing zombies' heads with my biceps and all that shit. But for now, it's time to be quiet. Situated in northwest Raccoon City, where we are searching for the helicopter of our compatriots, Bravo Team, who disappeared during the middle of their mission. Bizarre murder cases have recently occurred in Raccoon City. There are outlandish reports of families being attacked by a group of about ten people. Victims were apparently eaten. The Bravo team was sent in to investigate, but we lost contact. Look, Chris! Bravo team's helicopter was a derelict. Save for the remaining body of Kevin. Per we Kevy. We continued our search for the other members. And it turned into a nightmare. the one that has the grenade launcher later on. That's just the end. There are only three STARS members left now. Captain Wesker, Jill, and myself. We don't know where Barry is. I know where he is. Is everyone all right? Barry. Where's Barry? He's... No. What was that? 
I'll go and check it out. All right. Jill and I will stay in so the place. <laughs> Chris? Take care. Yeah. Okay. Um so stars is it stands for special tasks and rescue squad, I think it is. Um basically they're sent in to deal with any issues really. We um this shiny item on the ground on the table here is a ink ribbon. That's how I save the game. So as you can tell I only have six slots. Um, my health is of course on the left hand side there with the wee um it's not an ECG. Uh we trace, I can't remember what I can't remember what's called. Anyway, you'll find that the camera in this game um is terrible. Let me turn that down, I think that's a bit high. Now if I remember correctly, I should be able to touch this. Yes. Take the shield. From the start screen, select an item and then select examine. Okay. So you should be able to find a few wee bits and bobs. Okay, that's just a wooden one. Um, some of them sometimes have something on them, like a code maybe, or a certain um, shape so that something fits into it. So that one doesn't seem to, that's fine. I have three ink ribbon, so that's for saving. Now this is, uh, this is when it goes downhill. This camera angle is just the nostalgia. <laughs> Hello, and this is see, this used to really screw you up because whenever you went up to here, it would end. <laughs> You can't see anything. Right. Right. From what I remember, if I go through this door, it should proc the zombie running through as well. Like a wee small cutscene. Um, but then again, I played as Jill, so I'm not... ...too sure. Okay, it must only happen for Jill then. Um, basically, if Jill, if you play as her, um, you should actually check out uh, Hayden's channel. He decides to do the Jill playthrough, which is why I'm doing Chris. But Jill and Barry are investigating. Barry's currently sitting here by the kneeling over by the blood on the floor. And uh the zombie bursts through and Barry wrecks it with his big dirty magnum. Which you have an option to get later on in the game, but I'm not gonna tell you what you have to do. Now, the zombie Is he still no, he's down this way. At least they kept the other way in, I guess, so as you see, I'm just pushing the trigger and it's Pull me towards him. No. Oh dear. I forgot how crap the knife is. Why have I got a knife? That's a good point. Oh no! Oh no! No! Get off my biceps! Jab! Jab! God damn it! I really want the pistol. Fuck me, my health wrecked already. How much health does this guy take? How much? Ugh, how many rounds does this guy not take? Rounds? I'm not shooting anything. That's just how fucked up it's going to be right now. Alright, let's kite him a minute. Finally! Holy crap. First kills are special, that's true. Um. See the thing is, because what's the holding? Um, that thing. Any second, sorry. Any video player to see what happens? Okay, that's fine. Um, if you don't burn the zombies, they actually will come back, and uh, when they come back, they become what's called what's known as a crimson head zombie. They sprint and are a lot harder to kill, so the only way to get rid of that is if you burn them um, with kerosene and the just a, I think it's just a lighter you get. 
But sadly, I don't think Chris starts with a lighter. Um, I don't think he starts with anything in hard mode. I'm not sure. I know Let's Jill start. has a lockpick. Jill? Where did they go? In the other room to the right. Yeah, thank you, Jill. Yes, thank God. <laughs> um, I really could do the herb. That's the healing system, by the way. There's a uh, green herbs, red herbs, and a r blue herb. I think I don't know if blue herbs are in this one or not, but I think they are. Blue cures poison. Um, red herbs are combined with a green herb. Let me get this first. Um, to basically fully heal you. Um, I am just, I'm just getting flooding memories of just playing as my brother's kid. Uh, there's another zombie around the corner here. Um, so I will get him in a minute once I get this. Get. See. Oh god, the camera angles. Right, there. I think it's the map, maybe. Yeah. Okay, sweet. The red doors are obviously locked. Um, blue doors are ones I've been through. Great, I haven't been through. There's a gem upstairs, which I want to get. But I'll not be able to use it later on, so I will leave it on the floor um, for now. But I'll, I'll have it um, sitting there, ready to go, basically. This should take me above the dining room. And there should be a zombie. Now, I see that nice blue gem, which is... Looks like my car just look, looking at it. But obviously he's not. I need to... Um, First, that statue off the balcony. But first, I need to kite a zombie. Come on, zombie. Ooh, dagger. I forgot that was there, if I'm honest. Come on, Mr. Zombie. That's enough. If I run right here, you're still following me. If I give him the, wee, give him the slip, if you know what I mean. We cheeky run round. Right. Now while he's making his way round, I will get this puzzle done. And oh, I should still have time for you, Pierce. Okay, good. Plenty of time. So that statue's now broken. Um, so I'm not only a burg I'm not burglar. <laughs> I'm not only trespassing, but I'm also. Uh, destroying properly, so it'll be a bit of vandalism as well. Every door appears locked, apart from that, but I can't go into there yet until I get a arrow or something. Now I want to show you down here, um, I'll not be going down here till near end game, but it's how creepy this she is. Nope, 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 nope. Oh god, nope. Oh god. I just remembered how creepy she is. Oh, she's got fucking shackles on her hands. Oh. And you crawl through your bedroom later on, and it just gets weird. No, blue gem. I'm not gonna pick it up. Don't have room. No. I need them for herbs, which, if I'm not uh, mistaken, they are just around the corner. Hopefully this zombie should be on the right hand side. You can tell I've played this way too much. Oh no, he's dead, isn't he? That's why he's dead. He'll become crimson if I don't burn him, so I need to find kerosene. Um can't express how important that is. Is there no, not a zombie yet. Now I remember there's loads of birds later on trying to kill you in here, so that's it's a relief that they're not here yet, because I would die. 
so we'll take this a herb. Now these are what you used to heal you. <laughs> to heal you. This is what you used to heal yourself. Um, I will speak properly. A single green herb heals a bit, but if you combine two green or a green and a red, it basically heals you to full health. So that's me back to fine. I have full motion, and it is great. I, oh god, the camera angles. There we go. Give, give me the magazine, man. Okay, so that's 30 rounds. Not too bad. I'm, st I'm still running around the pistol. There we go. Okay, I was going to say there's a zombie, but it's a different staircase. Yeah, it is. Oh, it's, it's hard. It's like... This way, isn't it? But there's most definitely. Oh, yep. Oh god, he wears sweaters. Is he? That's all right. Okay, so of course the bad thing is with a zombie like that, um, and no kerosene, he will become a crimson head, which is not what I want at all. Shit, okay. Well, this one will take about seven rounds. Two, three, four, five. Wait for me to get back up again? Oh, maybe not. Um, that's not good. So I kind of need that. I need the tip of the, uh, the item to be precise. Okay, I'll try and find. Oh, okay, I unlocked it. I need to find a um, storeroom or a safe room. You'll know what you know what um, they are as soon as you walk in. Due to the uh, the music of the place, it's like a wee melody place. I really don't want to spend too long in here because they will become crimson head zombies. Not right now. Especially that one on the floor. Okay. Does this take me to the staircase near the... No, this takes me to an area I don't need to go to for a long time. Okay. No, I need to, need to use that spear tip somehow. Um... No, oh, no, 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 I do not want that. Not yet. Now, in that um, mirror, by the way, is where you'll find um, your character's costumes. If they put it in this game, I'm not sure they did. If they did, that's really cool. But you go in there, basically, to change how your character looks. No. Examine. No, use. This should allow me to access the area in the garden. Um, I currently think it's a bit early, but that's just where my head's like, I think I have to go here, so. If you can't trust yourself, who can you trust, eh? You stay on the floor. God damn, these camera angles. <laughs> The reason they put these door animations in was so that as soon as you went through the door, you don't know if there's a zombie waiting for you. Um, but man, that doesn't make it any better. <laughs> the camera angles make it really hard to tell. Emblem of armor. If there's a zombie right in front of you or not. No, I don't think I have to go down here, but I just thought I'd uh, check it out while I'm here. Okay, it's locked. Sword. I need the sword key. Um, because there's a lot of doors so far that are 
that require that sword key. Because <laughs> we just do like we run the 360. Imagine if a person actually ran like that, would be so good. Just run straight, just <laughs> That would be so cool. You would get dizzy very quickly though. I'm gonna put. Never mind. Although I'm starting to think, should I? Hmm. Okay. Here's my thought process right now. From what I remember, as soon as I get into the garden area, which I'm heading to now, there is like a sort of a, a mini boss. I'm gonna call it. And uh, I'm thinking, should I put the shield above the fireplace again, and then go back and pick up the ammo that's sitting at the mirror? It's a bit of a hike to go back, obviously, but obviously 30 rounds is better than 15. Unless you're bad at miles, and then you won't really know, I guess. But. Let's see how plan A goes, which up oh, we 360 just to make sure. If only you could lie down, be 360 no scopes with a pistol. Hey. Now there should be a zombie out here. I will kite because I'm oh make legend. Ah, put your shirt on, you fat bastard. Now. This is where you need the arrowhead for, you see. Now, because I already um, knew about it, I was able to get that straight away, but um, if you don't, obviously you come here first, you'd see that you need to go in here, and then Bob's your uncle finds your aunt, and we die. I really hope they can't follow me downstairs, because that's kind of shit. No. I need to Mask. It's right here, isn't it? Big of curses, why not? Now, if I remember. That's why examining things in this game is very handy. Um, so I got the mansion key. Okay, now I can open it up and it gives me a story. Book of Curses. The four masks. A mask that speaks no evil, a mask that smells no evil, a mask that sees no evil, and a mask that cannot see or cannot speak, smell, or even see evil. When all four are into place, evil will awaken. Which is what I was mentioning with the, uh, the wee boss, which is right above me there. Are they coming down the stairs? Please don't be. Oh, hey guys. It's gonna give you a wee. Oh, damn skills. Now, what's over here? I don't have a shotgun, so that's kind of pointless at the moment. I will leave that there. And I'll try and remember about it, which I won't. I've already forgotten. Right, so I've got the key to the mansion. I don't know if the key has a sword emblem on it. I'll have to examine it. I think it is the sword emblem, though. It would make sense. Because a lot of things in here seem to be requiring a sword. There we go. See? Sword key. Da 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 da! I really want to find. I know that there's a safe space. Soon. So I'm just gonna find it here. 
over there. Along the right hand side, I think it is. So I need to go downstairs and to the right. Just to find a safe zone so I can drop in a few items here. Um keep we herb for later on, probably. <laughs> 